I always love a good decorating challenge and I think that the holiday season is a great time to put yourself to the test and try some new things. HomeSense asked me to create two different vignettes that would showcase the bar cart, which is a great challenge because the bar cart is an item that we don't see very often nowadays. They're really versatile pieces and that's what we tried to showcase with these vignettes. The bar carts at HomeSense start at $149, so you can really pick one you love and use it for your holiday entertaining. To pull together my two looks, I went to HomeSense naturally and I browsed the extensive selection of holiday decorations, furniture, home accessories, and I pulled some things that I really love. So we created two different vignettes, both very distinct but that showcase this wonderful item. The first vignette we created was inspired by a bohemian, art-loving, well-traveled couple. I love to dream up the kind of people that would live in these spaces and the kind of parties that they would throw, so it's always fun to use your imagination and to decorate a space um, according to the homeowners that you've dreamt up. I love the gallery wall in this vignette and I think it's because it mixes all different kinds of mediums and prints. The key to a successful gallery wall ultimately is choosing art that you love. And so we chose pieces that we loved that really had a nice affordable range in price. They actually started at $24. I also think that the beautiful calligraphy prints, which are so affordable, make beautiful gifts to give to loved ones at Christmas, especially when they say lovely sayings or things that pertain to the holidays. I always try to incorporate at least one wood accent in every space that I design. I think it's always that amazing finishing touch and in this case we selected this beautiful carved wooden side table and I love how it contrasts next to this very, very modern white leather and chrome chair. One of my favorite pieces that we incorporated in this vignette is the wool poof, uh, which we just sort of threw on the rug, and I kind of love that it was kind of floating in the space. Again, when I entertain, I want my guests to feel very comfortable and at ease, and having low chairs invites people to sit on the floor with their legs crossed, the plate of food, and just chat the night away, and I think that this wool poof is a great example of how you can create a really cozy, entertaining space. So here the bar cart really functions as something that has nothing to do with being a bar. It's just this beautiful piece of furniture on which to display desserts and sweets and a tea station. And when that party is done, it'll become a place to display art and beautiful accessories. For the second vignette, I wanted something that had very high contrast to the first vignette. This one was about creating um, a mood, doing something that had a lot of richness, that was very dapper and very sophisticated. As soon as I saw this very large piece of art, I knew that it was perfect for our space. It had a ton of rich colors in it. It also had a bit of a mod vibe to it, and when we hung it on our blue wall, it was just meant to be. I selected a pair of these dark burnt orange armchairs with a really high back, and that to me is a great ode to the 50s. They feel really, really luxurious and sophisticated. The armchairs are $400 each, which is very affordable considering how comfortable and luxurious they look. When I placed that table lamp on the bar cart, I knew that it had found its place and it really became one of the stars of this vignette. This gorgeous table lamp is only $70, which is such a deal for such a showstopper. We added a gorgeous brass champagne bucket to the bottom shelf of our bar cart and in it we put a few champagne bottles. So that's great for a party, but if you're not entertaining, it's also a great place to store wine bottles. If you don't want to have a big wine rack down there, I think it's a much cleaner look. This one is only $40. Although this room feels slightly dark and quite moody, there is a lot of bright jewel tones in here and I love how all these colors work together and they pop. I particularly love how the brass of the bar cart looks against that gorgeous deep blue wall. 
I wanted to use the bar cart in its most traditional manner. So a really sophisticated bar space with beautiful crystal tumblers and glassware and some accessories like cocktail shakers. And show that even though, you know, not everyone takes the time to make a beautiful cocktail when they go home from work, it is a treat to have something like that in your home, particularly during the holidays when you're doing so much entertaining.